And President William Ruto has faulted the composition of the Pending Bills Verification Committee that was unveiled today by the National Treasury Cabinet Secretary, Professor Njugu Nandungu. Speaking during the launch of the committee at State House Nairobi, President William Ruto termed the committee as unconstitutional, noting that it does not meet the two thirds gender threshold. Meanwhile, genuine public sector pending bills will be the first items to be charged in the government budget. President William Ruto has said it is time the government sorted out the sticky issue in a just and fair manner. There is already a pending bill out there, owed by government, both at both levels, at the national and county, with all parastatals and all the other auxiliary bodies of close to 640 billion. That is a huge amount of money on either side, to suppliers and also on the government books. And therefore, it is important for us to resolve this matter and we can then predict our future much more accurately. It is also the reason that we are having a supplementary budget in Parliament. We have made a commitment as an administration that we are going to start with this year. Even as we look on last year, the year before, all the way to 2005, we are going to start with this year. And we have sent to Parliament an adjustment to the budget so that the pending bills that would have come into this year are sorted out. And 77 billion odd of pending bills, we have instructed that they be subsumed into this year's budget. And it becomes the first charge of every ministry, every department. And I want to say, it should be the case for every county government so that we can deal with pending bills as a matter of course.